Hey guys, what's going on? In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add custom funds to your Steam wallet. So first of all, we're going to open um, Steam website in our browser. It doesn't matter which one, but it has to be browser. It cannot be Steam application. Um, so we're going to do that. We're going to click on Steam and we're going to log on into our Steam account. That's very important. Then we're going to click on the money that we have under our uh, Steam tag. So this is, for example, in my case, 21.02 cents sorry euros um, and then we're gonna click on add funds to your steam wallet okay afterwards after we are here um, we're gonna click on f12 to inspect the elements and we're going to click on this arrow and the dot line surrounds it and we're gonna click on the button itself and in the inspection we can see data amount property uh, we're going to change this property so this is the property that is passed on to backend of the server and this is the amount of money that you will be able to transfer so it will not uh, be visible to you but you will see at the end that it's actually the amount of money that we're going to transfer so right here it says 500 because in five euros there are 500 cents so just imagine there are no decimals and this is just in cents so let's say we want to transfer five euros in 69 cents so we write five six nine without the decimal and we click enter okay that's about it but we can close the inspection element and we can click on add funds one more thing to mention is that you cannot transfer less than five euros to your steam wallet because that is the minimum and it even says minimum fund level if it's below that it said it will say there is an error in transaction so we're going to click on add funds. Okay, so once we get to this point, uh, we have the we have to select the payment method. So in my case, this is going to be Mastercard, and I'm going to enter the information right now. So let me... and I'm also going to uncheck save my payment information. Uh, so check out this next time because I don't advise you that just in case someone breaks into your account. Then we're gonna hit continue, and as you can see right here it says that a total is going to be 569 so this is the amount of money that we entered before so we can basically if you have euros uh, you can enter uh, something above five but not below five euros so you cannot just you know uh, transfer one cent unfortunately and as you can see this is what it says what it's going to do and obviously click on i agree to this and click on purchase so currently it says that there is a payment authentication required so I'm going to go on to my personal app for the money transfer and there we go so I've transferred uh, the amount of money let's see what happens now so it says payment authentication was done and it says thank you for your purchase there is a confirmation code um, and the amount of money that I have assigned to my account 